Hey there peeps, Mimi here and welcome back to Dun Machi Memoria Freeze and today is Monday, July 30th, the second to last day of this month and oh my gosh my phone and we are going to be talking about the new content update and I don't know why we're doing this on a Monday but we are so let's get to it we have a new gotcha right off the bat so midsummer's love uh, lover's tail gotcha and we already have eyes and let um hestia right here and we are holding a midsummer lover's tail gotcha time limited four star lefia amid eyes lily hestia and misha and swimmer outfits are newly added Yes, we have six new swimsuit gals. Like I said in my previous video, this was coming. There were spoilers that this was going to happen, and there's five new gotchas associated with it. Banner 1 has Lefia, Hestia, and Amid. It is another, another, um, what's it called? Another step banner, so you can get a four-star shirt on the first, fourth, seventh, and tenth seven. We also have another banner with Ice, Lily, and Misha. They're all very cute. But we don't know what they do yet, so we'll we'll get to that at um, the later portion of this video. So there's gonna be a banner that is paid gotcha for either a mid or left yet, just depends on your luck. It's for paid irises. Then we have Lily with um, Ice, and then we have Hestia with Misha. So I'm very curious to see what these gals do very curious so time limit units might be available in the future again so maybe next year if you don't get them this time so this one here is just a pickup gotcha for chigusa it works the same way on your first on your fifth draw you are sure to get her on your fifth draw you're sure to get her if you don't have her already and you want her you could go for her but i think your irises would be better spent on the summer units that are time limited and would leave if you have a lot of viruses and want to go for her go for it especially like if you're one away from max limit breaking and she's actually part of your team then it is a worthy investment always think about what you want to invest in your game also we have long walks on the beach campaign um, on this campaign I love a font I love the little heart we have the beautiful Ina please see below for more details on this campaign it is a big six campaign number one this is remember reminding me of like anniversary already so number one we're having a login bonus we're gonna be able to get up to a hundred irises it looks like four hundred thousand volleys three star gotcha ticket and three hero fauna over the span of 14 days this is pretty great getting more irises as a bonus is awesome so, of course, you have to complete the tutorial in order to be able to get these login bonuses, but I'm sure if you've been here with me for a long time, you, you've probably been through this. <laughs> so, number two, welcome back login bonus. So, for players that have not logged in for 14 days or more, you can get 100 irises, um, 6 2-star tickets, 1 3-star ticket, and a 4-star ticket. So, if you've let the game go for a little bit, this is, you know, a good time to come back. You can get those extra 100 irises and all those tickets. That is very nice. Then you can get a ex number three. You can get an exclusive wallpaper. The wallpaper gift uh, celebration of the start of the Midsummer Lover's Tale. Please download and save the images from the URL below. There are some URLs right there. I, I think I'm gonna have Hesty on my phone because she's such a cutie. Okay, number four. EX quests have been added to Exilia Valleys and Fauna quests. So there's gonna be some. There are some extra difficulty quest for Exilia Valleys and Faunas. We'll go look at them, uh, but basically you can um, fight against a pow uh, an opponent powered up uh, from the last time. You can also end the drop items that are in the regular quest. So we'll go check those out. Um, then we have number five. All Fauna quests unlocked during the period. That's awesome. So from right now to 820, they are all unlocked for an entire month. Yeah, well, almost like a month. Then we have number six. Gnome Ticket Exchange has been added. Gnome Ticket 
will be added to the shop. You can exchange your gnome tickets in, spe in shop, special exchange, gnome ticket exchange. See the notices. Okay. Also, low key. Um, oh, there's a few more things. Oh my gosh. So, version 4.2.0 update introduction. So, with this update um, for the application, we have a few more things. So, we've got a rental unit feature that has been added to the new event. Basically, the rental unit is available with a new tele event that starts today, and it will allow the quote unquote rental unit to join you as you progress the event and having that unit in your party while clearing the event quest. The rental unit can officially join your party when it's quote unquote girl power means it's level requirement. Please see the, new, uh, the news about the event. Um, so we'll, we'll go see that. But she, it, it's his rental on top in pink and then you'll eventually get her GP leveled up. Oh, and once you level it up, you can get gnome tickets. Nice. I was concerned about not having enough gnome tickets, so you you have to use her. You you have to use her, and, and the more you use her, you will level up her GP girl power, and eventually you can get her. I like this. If a rental unit officially joins your party, the unit will be usable after the event end. A rental unit will be lost after the event end if didn't join. Gnome ticket ha exchange has been added, so from today you can use it. Um, and we'll, we'll go look at those things. Uh, the highest difficulty EX extra has been added. So apart from very hard, you'll be able to do these upgraded upgrade quests and you can earn even more items uh, to level up your units. Don't miss it. And yeah, all the, one, all the units will be unlocked. Also, you can get some irises by completing these. Go do it. Attack resist has been added to an enemy status screen. Attack resist has been added to an enemy status screen uh, which can be viewed by long pressing your enemy. So basically you can just see if they have any attack resist. So like physical or magical. And thank you for continuing support of Tenmachi. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so then, if we keep scrolling, we have, oh my gosh. Um, okay, we'll get there. We'll get there. Tale, Midsummer's Dream, Lover's Tale, now available. So a reward for the, um, a reward for this event is Four star unit for every first time. Okay, level up girl power in game and obtain a four star Midsummer's Maiden, Aina Tulek. You can also limit break the unit by progressing through the event. A tell it's a story, it's long, um, and talking about girl power, level up the girl power and get the four star uh, my, uh, Midsummer Maiden. So this time after playing one eight, she'll um, Aina will join as a rental unit. You can include the rental unit um, in your party for a limited time, and once you know, like we said, when her girl power is to the right level, she can um, be used after the event, and so we get to keep her. And you can level it up by clearing quests of the event with uh, using her in the party, and you can earn luxurious items such as Midsummer's Maiden Bond, a gnome tickets, and an outfit for her, um, the shiny swimwear, by using um, by just playing. And by using the bond, you can earn up to five. You can limit break her to max. Her status will highly increase with limit break, so of course, don't miss out. That is very nice that they're giving us a four-star unit in an event. They hadn't done this before, so this is really cool. And so yeah, just use her, you'll level it up, and eventually when uh, you get to the right level, you will be able to keep her for you. So I'm very excited to be able to do this. Um, you can gather the swimwear medals, so you can um, do things in the exchange shop. Also, you can use the new metal, uh, the medals that you get um, to be able to draw from an event gotcha. So that's nice. I like event gotchas. Um, let's see, gather event items to read stories. Yeah, so to progress, kind of what we were used to here. And Getting this shiny swimmer cannot be earned just by getting her unit. You have to level up her um, girl power to the required level or else you won't get her. Um, also it says, oh, it's just telling you how much um, sedials you'll get. You won't get dulled for selling her bond, you'll just get sedials. Well, that's interesting to know. Okay, and I think the last thing on here
I think I skipped one, but okay. Did I skip this one? Yes, I skipped this one. The spend the swim medals to collect items. The, so spend the swim medals um, and you can use them on the gotcha. And there's a high chance to get a three star um, gotcha ticket, so that's nice. And the item lineup can be. Um, you can proceed through it uh, by resetting the gotcha, so you can get one three star ticket and just keep resetting until you get everything you need. And as you go, like usual, like um, the chances of getting different items increases or decreases. And also, the mid interact has been added. And full voice isn't available right now, but it will be available later on. Cool. And let's see what else do we have. Rampage for August is open. Basically, the weapon for here is Lilia's Ballista Robin. So that's cool. Of course, there's a lot of irises hiding in there. Do Rampage. Can't specify that enough. So basically, they're trading today as the last day of the month. And there's different monster drops. As always, it's worth doing. And get the event drops. Uh, well, not the event drops, but the material drops in order for you to be able to craft different weapons for your characters. There is, It's totally worth it. And this one was well, is old, so we're not talking about that one. Choo, 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 choo. That is it, and I believe, did I talk about 4.2? Yes, we already talked about 4.2. And last but not least, <laughs> the gnome ticket exchange is not available. Basically, 200, tic uh, 200 tickets gets you a love and draw, 500 gets you a uh, four star gotcha ticket. You can get a star bond, assist, and adventure for um, with those tickets for a thousand, a thousand five hundred. And I didn't, I don't have that many. I have like four hundred and something. So I'm just kind of a little bummed out that I am not um, going to be able to get some of the rewards. But I did see that you can get some gnome tickets by um, completing um, her um, anus girl power. So do that. Get those. Um, Go get those extra gnome tickets and hopefully you can get higher rewards. Maybe there, um, let's quickly go look at the event and see. Oh. Your rental unit you know, will join you in the party. Okay. Yeah, so we've already talked about this. Now, if you go to the gotcha, you cannot get gnome tickets in it. But you can get the three star ticket. Also, I already love this. I'm going to farm this event like no other because they're CP items. And you know what happens when you get, you know, your CP up, you get higher, you know, higher little, you know, power-ups to your characters. And also, you can get some irises in there and other little things. So it's worth, you know, farming this event. Increase, you know, the bond with your units. And, oh my gosh, that has been a lot for the update. I thought I'd be done so much sooner. But, you know, that is it for the content update. So this is purely just a content update for um, for this event. And also I do see the arena it has a little exclamation mark. Record Buster did start. So the new Record Buster is there. I didn't see the notice. It's probably hiding in there. Just the notices don't sort uh, very nicely. So that's the thing. And special exchange for gnome tickets. I only have 409. I'm gonna wait until this event is over, see if I can get more just by um, leveling up Ina. Maybe there um, there's more ways to get gnome tickets coming up because I was not lucky in that gotcha during anniversary. But it is what it is. So peeps, thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed me just kind of going through the updates. I, I like just kind of going over them and recapping just so we all know what's going on. So you will see a video from me coming out tomorrow. I'm going to talk about the girls. We'll just, you know, recap them, figure out what they do. Maybe I'll do a summon, depending on which girl we, we want to go for. But until next time, thank you all so very much for watching. Yeah, meow.